Get down! I think there's about to be a home invasion. I think there already has been. Do I know you? I'm Max from your history class. Relax, I just need to spend the night. I'll be gone by morning. I hardly know you. Can't you find a friend's house to stay at or something? A friend's house? It's like you hardly know me. That's what I just said. Shh. There's a car out front. I think they followed me. Do you have a gun? What? Of course not. Oh my god, you're useless. Stay away from the window. Do you want to get shot in the brain? No. Look, I'm just here because I knew I wouldn't have any trouble with parents. I heard that your dad just left and you're living all alone? Yeah. Three days ago. The wound's still fresh, man. What are you talking about? That's the best thing that could ever happen to you. Nobody holding you back? Except for me, now? God, I've been trying to get away from my parents for years. Shh! Somebody's walking out the car. He's walking to your door. Pizza delivery. That'll be $20. Thank you. Keep the change. Uh, this is a five. Yeah, so I suspected it was the pizza guy, but you know, you can't be too safe. Want a slice? Wait, how did you know about my dad leaving? <laughs> my sharp detective skills. Also, you told me in class and then you broke down crying. Wait, you was a detective. Why does that sound familiar? Wait, you were on that kid's detective show, weren't you? I don't know what you're talking about. Though. Yeah, it was like Sesame Street mixed with CSI. You were the star of that. No, I wasn't. Yeah, you're right. Penny the Puppet pretty much stole the show. Screw that puppet! I was the star of that show, not some stupid puppet. I was the main character. That puppet can go to hell! It's okay. Look, I don't want to hear another word about that show. Yes, it was me, but I've left that all behind. I'm a real detective now. But also a high school student? That's more of a hobby. Look, Brian, it's Dave. I'm, I'm going to sleep now. I'll be needing the basement. Exclusively. And I know we go to the same school, but if we could stagger the times we walk there, that would be great. Because I'd love to avoid spending any time with you. See you tomorrow, if necessary. Actually, I'm very, well, why did the camera cut from me? Back to the topic. I'd like to begin by presenting <laughs> some basic information from both sides to <laughs> Cut. That was great. I think our back and forth banter really makes the show. Um, no, you are here to be my backup, okay? Sit quietly and laugh when I make a joke. You are allowed to speak three times per episode, and you use all of your opportunities in the first 60 seconds. Miley, 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 Miley. We're a classic comedy duo. Key and Peel, Tina Fey and Amy Poehler, Obama and Biden. Please just be quiet. I will do you one better, the exact opposite. Hey, what size hammers do you have? A sledgehammer. Do you have a sledgehammer? A sledgehammer would be very useful in this moment. A, a sledgehammer? Didn't you say you were moving out by now? Yeah, well, you know, it's just been kind of hard trying to find my own place, you know, especially with your constant complaining. Seriously, what are you even doing here? Oh, I'm waiting for my cousin Charlie. He called last night to see if he could come over and I said... Oh, okay, so he just invited himself over. God, how rude. Oh. 
How about that hammer? This is going to be a fun trio, isn't it? Hey, Charlie, how you doing, buddy? What the hell? So not good? Get out. I don't want to see your face. Don't you know each other? We were co-stars in the highly successful children's detective series. <sighs> okay, we were not co-stars. He was my sidekick. Charlie, I never remember seeing you on the show. He was never on screen. He was the guy on the phone that gave me instructions. And where would you have been without those instructions? Lost! I made you what you are. They tried to fire you? That was because of systematic racism. I'm two-fifths black. Charlie, I'm your cousin. I know that's not true. Oh. Why are you here? Have your parents finally gotten enough of your failure? Max, don't be mean. Yes? Well, technically they said that they'd be perfectly fine me going home if I gave up all this acting stuff, but I proved them all wrong and told them that I moved to L.A. But you didn't actually move to L.A., so... Well, it doesn't really matter because I'm not going to stay here with Max. Dave, I'm so sorry for telling you this so last minute, but I'm going to have to move out by the end of the week. Well, I'm going to move out by the end of the day. Well, then I'm going to move out by the end of the hour! In fact, I have to go to a meeting for my successful talk show called Miley Squad. Your name's not even in the title. Uh, the title is about me. She's Miley, but I'm Miley Squad. <laughs> She's the one who should be upset, <laughs> not me. I found some comments. Great show. Keep them coming, Miley. You're awesome, Miley. None of those are about you. Uh, check your facts, Max. What kind of detective are you? Look at this one. Who's that other guy? He creeps me out. That's right! I'm that other guy! I'm essentially the star. Oh, I'm so done. I came up looking for a hammer and all I got was this tool. Oh, wordplay? Two can play at that game. Uh, I meant like, later. I don't have anything clever to say right now, but uh, I'm an actor, not a writer. <laughs> that was more intense than anticipated. Look, Dave, I love you like we're family. We are family. We're cousins. So I'm gonna warn you. Don't trust that guy. He'll pretend to be your friend to get what he wants and then stab you in the back right when your show's about to be renewed for a third season. That seems more specific than the situation, but thanks for your advice. Through the studio. Was that a red camera that I saw? Those cost like $100,000. Yeah, we're upgrading. Official. We're gonna be part of NBC's online content division secondary website as their new original series. That is incredible. Not to brag, but this could be my big break. Wait, how did you afford to buy new equipment? We had to cut the budget a little bit in the acting department. The acting department? But that's just you and me? Miley. Oh God, no! Sorry, Charlie. I just want you to know that I really enjoyed making this show with you and I just wish I could keep being your co-star. Yeah, it was fine. But with you fired, I promise I will be the best lead the show has ever seen. No, idiot, you're fired. Yeah, says the person who just got fired. What? How can you keep the show going without me? I'm the title character. I'm Miley Squad. Yeah, that's not what that means. I was about to propose to you that we add a cooking segment. Look, if it makes you feel any better, it's not you. It's me. As in, they don't want you. They want me. Either the mic is off, or they're being very quiet. If you do this to me, I swear to God, I will kill myself. I have already recorded the video suicide note, which is perfectly acted. Okay, well, I'm gonna give you a few minutes to cool off. I'll be back in five. Yeah, well, just leave me here with a noose or something. This is the last time you'll see me alive, and it's all your fault, which the suicide note. Oh boy, it's Works every time. I wonder what they're saying. 
Why don't we meet back up after this idiot stops taking pictures of us? Uh, it's for a nature photography class. You know, feel free to keep talking. Where's my phone? Who are you? The question is, who am I? Detective Max Chu. Are you gonna arrest me? I don't work for the police. Oh, so you're not a real detective. Yes, I am. But without any of the power? What are you, 16? Come with me.